here's my makeup holder. I started getting these birch boxes um, a few weeks ago. I ordered them out of boredom. So I really, I think the boxes are cute. So I'm going to try to keep a lot of stuff in there. They're also like nice and small, so they'll take up less space. The rest of this makeup box, um, it's not too bad. I took out a lot of the makeup that I wasn't using anymore. There's also some things that don't belong in here, like uh, um, this. I don't know what that is. This marker. All right, here we go. Now we have everything that I would want to keep. Everything else is taken out. So we took out all the things that would be considered trash, which actually I didn't have that much. Um, like a cotton ball, I think. A tip slash trick that I thought of. If you are missing a lot of jewelry or you have like so many earrings that you can't find the match to, Doing this, like organizing something that you have that's supposed to have only makeup in it, is going to be very good because you will definitely find at least a couple of matches to your pairs of earrings, if not a whole, a whole pair. Oh, look at Tuck over there. He's being such a good boy. Oh, he is so cute. Anyways, now we're going to see if we can fit everything that I want as makeup into these two boxes. Tip for cutting down on the amount of stuff you have. Just buy one nice palette and try to stop yourself from, from buying other stuff. Just remember you have plenty here. The first thing that you should do is sort the items. So to me, grabbing all of your brushes, so I would even take this little, I really need to get a new one. Look at that. So we get all of our brushes and that is something maybe we can keep together. The next thing I'm going to look for is things to do with eye makeup. So anything to do with eyes, I'm going to take it. I got this in my last birch box and it is possibly the best, well definitely the best mascara I think I've ever had. All right, we have our eye products put away. Next we'll choose some of our skin products. So if it's some type of lotion or um, BB cream or um, foundation, that's what we're going to look for. So we also have lips. I only have one lip gloss here right now. I think, oh wait, no, I have two. I have a lip balm. The last things that we have are all hair products, which need to go, um, these I'm gonna put in the bathroom, like in the medicine cabinet where I keep most of my other hair products. Okay. So this is what the box, the container looks like. It's pretty dirty. I'm gonna try to wash it actually. It might be a lost cause. Well, I think we can put this to the side and we'll be able to figure out something that we can use it for. There's always something that we could put inside. So I'm going to put the products on top and the brushes on the bottom because I will definitely use these, so I want easy access to those. The last two things are our lips. So since this box that has eye stuff is pretty empty, we can definitely fit these two. The takeaway here, unless you really, for some reason, need a ton of makeup, then don't pay attention to this because it doesn't apply to you. If you don't wear that much makeup or you find yourself only wearing certain products 
all the time, like the ones that you like the best, just get rid of anything that you haven't used in over a year because it's not good to use anymore and you're probably not ever going to use it again and you're, you're not going to miss it. So get rid of it. Keep one palette. If you have maybe two that you absolutely love and maybe they're a little bit different from each other, then keep two. But really just keep one. This bathroom shelf looks so much better already. I really like this holder because it's, again, it's taller. So we can put all of our brushes and whatnot in there and um, they're not all sticking out and messy. This I need to just put somewhere else. Um, you know, I'm gonna just stick it in there. That's for another day. So. I think maybe we could actually put this up here and I could put my palette maybe to the side. That is that. So again, what we did is we figured out what we want to use this shelf for and we're using it for makeup, hair products, and hand towels. This is great. We got a lot of stuff cleaned up and we made use of this container for something else, which means we now have another container that we could use. 